Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and today I'm here with Dragalia Lost. That's right, I'm back. I didn't do one yesterday because of the over 1 hour and 30 minutes of Pokemon I played. But it's okay, because today we're going to actually play some Dragalia Lost. I also was crazy busy with work and stuff, but hey, what can you do? Today's video is going to be very clear. So here's the thing. Cayenne is very easy. I think everyone has understood this. The people who are currently, so I say it's easy, but there's actually a lot of people who struggle with it on Expert right now. And the reason is, is that all the people who are very good at Cayenne have already moved on to just autoing Cayenne. That's kind of like, so the actual funny thing is, is that all the people saying that Cayenne is too easy, well, they're gone. So... No one is here to help carry people through Cayenne on Expert, so it's actually kind of tougher now. Um, which is funny. I guess people get to experience a harder fight <laughs> without crazy uh, people going around, I guess. Um, but I digress. Today's video is, of course, going to be me playing Cayenne Standard solo, and we're just going to let the AI fight. Um, I will occasionally chime in and try and stop the AI, but that's basically all it is. It's going to be like... I was able to standard it, and to be fair, I was able to auto it before my Iasu was even fully mana spiraled out. All you really need is either Grace or Cleo, because they will constantly spam their Force Strike, and that Force Strike is the way to dispel the shields. Um, with Grace, it's much easier. The new unit Grace, if you have her, it's pretty easy. It's pretty easy to auto because her. See, this is the thing I was talking about. Um, finally, they were able to get it. The thing is, is, the only way for Cleo to dispel is that her skill 1 actually uses her, um, her move. So, uh, she needs to use skill 1 and then save her 4 strike. The problem is, is that the AI never saves a 4 strike. So what happens is that the AI just constantly, uh, spams both skill 1 and <laughs> the 4 strike, um, until the end of time. And what you basically want to hope for here is, um, that they just team up at the right time. It's completely random. Sometimes the AI is the AI and is very dumb and just dies. Um, it looks like they're doing pretty fine for right now. I don't see them having much trouble yet, but there's the break. Oh, Yasu is pretty close to dying though. Again, see, so she, Cleo already used her skill 1, so that means Yasu is dead. Rip Yasu. Um, as long as Cleo doesn't die, it's fine. You don't need Iyasu. All you really need is uh, enough units to kill him. <laughs> and he's pretty close to dying already, so it's fine. Um, but Grace doesn't have that problem. If you have Grace, I think it's actually possible to auto standard 100% without having to worry. I think right now, for me personally, where I'm at currently in the game, I have about a 75% win rate on auto um, right now. And the reason is that sometimes like the AI just doesn't like the the RNG isn't on my side and he just dies um, before I can actually do anything at all. Um, good job though, you guys are able to do it here. Um, I will not use my weeklies because I'm saving that for uh, um, the other one, the harder one, Volk. So I'm gonna go here. Also, you just can't repeat it. That's something that they at least would done. <laughs> if you ever wanted proof to show that, hey, you don't need, uh, the devs never planned for you to play this by yourself, it's the fact that there's no auto-repeat. You, they do not let you auto-repeat um, these. So you I have to go in and manually click repeat, please. I actually clicked the wrong thing. I should have clicked the repeat, but it's fine. But yeah, like I was saying, uh, if you have Grace, her shield will make it so it's actually impossible, kind of impossible for your units to die. Um, her shield is very good, and then her four strike has constant dispel, so you never have to worry about dispelling. See, like, right now, um, Cleo only got it at the end, because Cleo, uh, Cleo's um, skill one charge is not at the same rate as his, like, shield, if that makes sense. I think, I, I think you get it, but yeah. It's, Cayenne is very easy. There, no one is going to deny to you um, that Cayenne is easy. See, like, here it is. Oh man, we're having very bad RNG with the shield. But it's fine because Shadow is just so strong that they can beat him without having to do that. It certainly makes it easier. And I wish he would kind of keep up with it because, man, Iyasu is just constantly dying. He's full mana spiral too. Boy, why are you dying? Stop dying, Iyasu. <sighs> See, look, here's the part of the, where the AI is kind of like, I don't know what to do, man. And they're actually kind of losing a little bit here, but 
As long as Cleo keeps healing them, they should be fine. And there goes Yasu. Yasu, you need to not die, boy. I gave you a full mana spiral and you're gonna die? So this is definitely one of the ones where I think it's looking kind of rough. So I might... Mm, I might take over. No, I think I'm gonna keep it going for now. But, yeah, my team is nothing special. That My Kuran, for example, is not fully mana spiral. He's still at zero mana spiral. He's just at 50 MC. That's it. And that's only because I already had him at 50 MC and stuff like that. Yeah, they can beat it. That's the other thing they don't do is that the stuff where you're supposed to group up, they don't group up. They're very dumb about that. Umbra Eraser. Umbrella Eraser. We got this. Uh, is current? No, Cleo's going down. If Cleo dies, then there's no hope for this run. Alright. I'm interfering. There we go. That's the one thing that the AI will never do, is, sh is um, Dragon. So, they're also too dumb to skill out of the actual fight. So there you go. I took over for that one, because I felt like there was a good chance of them losing. Uh, that's what I mean by my me personally. It's inconsistent because my team is just like not at the higher levels of a lot of other people. Um, no, thank you. But it doesn't mean like I'm doing pretty. I think I'm doing pretty good, all things considered. You know what I'm saying? Standard is not. Um... No, there you go. I was really scared about Cayenne too, which is funny because the reason I was scared is because um, I make videos and stuff. So, if I can't do the harder stuff, that's actually been one of the things that I I'm always, like, afraid extinction. of for, specifically Dragalia, is that I'm not good enough for the we content that people have come to look at. So I'm, as I, I think it's, I made very clear, I'm very, like, I'm, like, somewhere between super casual and mid-tier. I'm not exactly mid-tier, because I want to say mid-tier people are better than me, but I want to say I'm somewhere between, I'm, like, a super casual. Well, no, super casual would be, would imply that I'm more casual than most people, but that's not it. I'm more skilled than your average casual, but I still feel like I'm actually in the camp of casuals. Um, it's not that I don't dislike harder stuff. I actually really like some of the high dragon stuff. Uh, not all of it. Some of it. I think in general that Agito stuff is better and more fun to play and learn. Um, I can also see there being a little bit of a trouble of like, ooh, there you go. That's what I was talking about. Here they are. Here they are, here to die. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, back. Uh... Okay, so I'm gonna keep Cleo alive. Because she's the thing that's gonna help us on this one. So I'm gonna try and... Ooh, that's bad. There's no saving this one, man. Again, like I said, inconsistent <laughs> for me specifically. I looked away for a brief second and he was able to completely kill us. Um, but yeah, the Cayenne thing is kind of easy because you can just skip all, a lot of the stuff that he does because you just deal so much damage. I feel a lot of that has to do with Shadow itself though. Shadow is just such a strong... Um, it's just such a strong team. There's like no denying that Shadow is one of the best... It's the best group, but you could, in theory, the best shadow group should be able to beat every single event in the entire game. But that's just kind of the, the nature of things. I don't know if that means that they maybe should change that? Maybe... Um, I don't know if they should change shadow, honestly. I don't feel like... If this was more of a PvP-heavy game, and there was something to compete against, maybe. But because a lot of the shadow stuff is kind of like, up to the person, like, I don't have to use Gala Alex. I use Gala Alex because it helps me with my grind stuff. But I don't have to use it. I don't have to use Yasu. I don't have to use my Manus Fire Cleo. I choose to do all this. Um, I choose to have the strong, one of the strongest Shadow teams on myself. Here's another thing that the AI is very bad about, is that they will constantly um, use their third skill if they have the Aikido weapon, which they're not supposed to do because it's bad. Um, not that the, mo the the skill itself is bad. What's bad is um, you're supposed to not constantly spam it. You're supposed to keep the 30% attack speed buff on you. It's better than most. There you go. See, Cleo was like able to have it on the ready, and that means this guy's basically toast. Umbro Eraser. Do it again! I can't believe you. I can't believe you've done this. I'm gonna interfere, just because I need her to win. 
Umbrella Racer. Umbrella Racer. I'm gonna go shoot Time for this. Perfect. Um, just to make it go by a little bit faster. Oh, you know, Shadow. Hmm. It's very strong. No one's gonna deny the fact that Shadow is very strong. Stronger than most other teams. That's probably why I feel like uh, High Mercury is still kind of tough for a lot of people, is because um, it requires you to actually learn all the kind of setups for it. If you screw up once, it's kind of game over for you. You serious? Just go in here and kick his ass. I don't understand what you guys are doing. There you go. Jesus Christ. CPU. Let me see how close I am to finishing my tree, actually. You didn't even need to die, girl. You don't need to die. No, thank you. If I'm going to use the weeklies, I may as well just use it on expert. I'm very interested to hear if people are having trouble with Cayenne Standard. Because if you are, tell me. Because I feel like the answer is not a lot of people have trouble with Cayenne on Standard. Expert, I think, is a little bit of a different story. Because I think a lot of the, the problem with um, what a lot of higher people don't see, I think, is that they usually might gate a lot of stuff. So it's like, yeah, it's easy, but also you've specifically kicked out a good portion of the entire community from actually participating in this fight. So, yeah, if you only play with the Don't highest level people, planning, then yes, it is extremely but easy. But even then, not plans. always, because there are definitely people who are bad, and things are currently a mess. As I said previously, all the best players are now just autoing um, Extreme Kai, because um, they can. And honestly, if they want to play that way, that's the way they're going to play. And then that means the actual... <laughs> Everyone else either has to learn to eventually get to their level, or just die a whole bunch. I don't know. But yeah, that's the end of today's video. I hope you liked it. Tell me how you feel about letting loose. No. Tell me how you feel about, um, stuff. I don't know, man. How you doing? Hope you're doing good. <laughs> if you're doing good, leave a like. <laughs> just kidding. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next, uh, Jigalia video. Goodbye.